been having some trouble with my brakes on this bike for a while now. I've tried bleeding the brakes completely. I've tried cleaning the rotors. Next step is to buy new pads, but before I buy new pads, I have a feeling the old ones are contaminated, so I just want to try one thing and see if that um see if that helps. So I've used 240 grit sandpaper on the pads there, um, just little pressure, just enough to bring off the top surface, just literally hand resting on it and moving backwards and forwards is just enough. Um, now I'm going to clean the discs again with isopropyl alcohol and then I'm going to go out and re-bed them and see if they actually work properly this time. Get these bad boys back on the bike. So that's the bike all back together. Now we're just going to go find somewhere where we can. Uh... I've forgotten the word for it. Wear them in. So now we just need to put the brakes through some heat cycles and hopefully they'll start to work. So it's the next day, um, I've just been editing the video, I've noticed I haven't done any kind of summary or anything like that or any outro, so I thought I would just come on here and put this on here quickly. Um, so is it worth doing? Do the brakes work as good as they did before they got contaminated? Um, the answer is no, they do work better, quite a lot better than what they did before, but they're still not like sort of a new pad would feel. Um, so I'm probably going to go out and buy some new pads for the bike anyway. And so that's it. If you've got any questions, put them down below. Hope you like the video and have a good day. <laughs>